Now, <clears throat> I do want to talk more about the safe state thing and the discussion there, but I do want to rewind over back to the debug menu. So debug menu is in play. Wii U VC is now like the version that people are on. So how are people feeling about it, Pope Scooter? What is the community's thoughts? What are your thoughts? Um, it's initially kind of a crisis for the community because there are some big downsides to the Wii U. Like, even though it's faster because of this big glitch, um, it, it adds on almost a full second to each load, like each load zone that you go through. Okay. Um, the input delay is... I, I don't know the exact number, four, but it is... Four millisecond input delay. As opposed to, what is it, two for Wii VC no, or like, something? Or no, less? It's less, it's less, less than zero. that? Yeah, yeah. It, it's pretty bad. Like, it's something that you could get used to, but it's very not ideal compared to what we're already used to playing on. Like, it, I, 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 it's pretty much an objective thing to say that the Wii VC version is better. Like, it's it's just better. The way it looks is better. Like, when you play it on the TV, it's in, like, a box. Like, the resolution <laughs> of the Wii U is, like, not stretched correctly on the TV. It's, like, literally a box that you're looking at. Like, everything is, like, like vertical. and 20% of the screen just has black. Around yeah, it. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like, it's, it, it's pretty funny. Like, Majora's Mask, for the longest time, just had the best any percent category for like completing all the dungeons you get to see most of the game the the Wii VC thing is cool um and then all of a sudden we find this big thing and like we're all playing on Wii U and like there's input delay and there's a bunch of like load zone uh like like lag and you know like it's we have to do like lag reduction stuff now like when we're on the moon going into Majora we have to be facing like away from the tree because it is literally just a PowerPoint slideshow trying to go <laughs> into Majora now. It is, it is pretty ridiculous. How is that possible? It's just like, I don't know what happens with how they downgraded from Wii VC to Wii U, but it is just, it's so, something. And it's definitely it, like caused a lot of conflict with It's opinions. not only that, too. It's the fact that, like... It also the game just also looks visually terrible because the yeah. Wii U Virtual Console has a darkness filter added to it oh, for yeah. for epileptic reasons, so to prevent yeah. seizures. So like when you play the game, it's just dark, and because Majora's Mask is a dark game, just normally it's it just looks so bad. Like sometimes you can't <laughs> yeah. even see anything because it's just. I've had so many people like like we open up the debug menu and there's two different kinds of debug menu you can open up. There's like a lighter and darker version for some reason. And the dark version is, like, so dark that you have to get, like, right next to your TV <laughs> yeah. to, like, look at, like, what's going on. You can't see anything. And it, it's also, yeah, just to add on to the the whole bad loading zones, the, the horrific input delay, it makes you feel like you're, like, sluggish playing underwater. We also, you know, don't have the... You can use a game, an adapter to play with a GameCube controller, but from from what I've heard, it's not a very good adapter and it doesn't play very well. So we've been using classic controller pros, which mm -hmm. aren't as good as GameCube controllers. So it just it doesn't feel as nice to play, just because that controller, not only in my opinion, is it less ergonomic, but also it just doesn't handle the same when it comes to like you know seeing Link's motions and like you know be, having full control over the character. Yeah. But also the pause buffering is a huge issue. One of the big things in Majora's Mask is frame perfect tricks and cutscene skips, and so. You know, just to give a quick rundown on cutscene skips, they take cutscene typically take two consecutive frames in a row to activate for some reason. And the way you buffer and skip cutscenes is you advance one frame at a time, never allowing the game a two frame window to start that cutscene. So if you trigger a loading zone without the cutscene starting, it'll overpower the cutscene from starting and just load the area that you enter. And so the the problem with Wii U is that you don't have control over how many frames advance in between a pause buffer. And so sometimes you get one frame, but sometimes you get more than one frame. And so all the cutscene skips that rely on that technique are just gone. You can't do them. <laughs> so it, it literally prevents being able to do a lot of frame perfect tricks like you can on the Wii Virtual Console. On Wii Virtual Console, it's really good. You can do really consistent pause buffering. It's basically a, a glitch that is 
it, it's just made the run so fast, but it's taken away so many other small increments of time save, like cool increments of time save. Mm -hmm. Like, you can't really skip cutscenes anymore. You can't do any sort of, like, like th there is a, a way to buffer called VC menu buffering, and basically you can, you can buffer... Uh, there, there's two different kinds of frames. There's input frames and there's visual frames. And on Wii U VC, um, you can't buffer a visual frame, but you can buffer an input frame. And there's three input frames per visual frame. So like to advance one frame, you need to do the VC buffering three times in a row. And it's like already making it slower. And it's, it's yeah. just... And wow. Not, not yeah. even can't be, skip a cutscene because a VC menu buffer isn't pausing in the game. Right, so right. You, so it wouldn't even work for a cutscene skip. I, I get to know you guys are talking a lot about obviously community is about the runners and stuff, and you guys talk about the runners' difficulties. Uh, but I know another voice that I like to bring up a lot here is the viewers' voices. And uh, the viewers are kind of showing their displeasure for sure, I think is the main. A lot of people don't like it for sure, I think is the kind yeah. of the. The, the the main opinion out there uh saying they're ruining any percent you know it's like you know any percent is done i don't like watching this anymore uh do you guys take any you know credence in that is, is there any there's some importance there too as you guys you, you guys uh make a living playing this game online so it, there has to be some kind of thought to that too right is this you know what, what are you guys thoughts about that what, what the community thinks about how this is to watch is it any fun anymore to watch um Actually, I mean, it is. <laughs> I, it's it's kind of like a thing where right now it's it's fun to do something kind of different. Like it's it kind of sucks to play on the console itself, but like just like doing another run and getting new splits and doing that is is like I still have fun. Like Phil and I have had fun playing through any percent um, recently, and it's not as fun I can see from a viewer standpoint. It is something new to watch, but. It's kind of like because of the input delay and how bad the controls are. It's kind of like watching two top runners start the game all over again because <laughs> we're like, yeah. we have like no control of our characters anymore. <laughs> so it's like, it, it's it's pretty funny. But um, I I do have to say that like a lot of uh, the viewers, I I would agree, they're not very happy with like the find, I guess. Mm -hmm. um, but like in the end, it is. For something like any percent, that that's just how speedrunning goes, and whether or not it's fun or not, I mean, or whatever, I mean, like that's that's yeah. just how it is with any percent. For other categories, it's a bit more arbitrary. Like you can have your own set of rules, which is what like we've already discussed with with people. But um, yeah, we're kind of just like trying to find the most entertainment that we can with with the run. Um, sure.